Now, here's meteorologist TJ Del Santo with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Not the prettiest of weekends, but we're looking at well, mainly dry conditions, at least for your Saturday. Let's take a look at what's happening. Live Pinpoint Doppler 12 radar. You can see we've got a couple of little sprinkles working across Connecticut and into Rhode Island and then kind of fizzling out. I think from here on out, mainly dry throughout the rest of at least the daylight hours. So for today, our threat tracker at that low level. Same for tonight and for now for Sunday as well. Although there is the chance for some thunderstorms tomorrow. We'll talk about the timing in just a second. Downtown Providence, we've got lots of clouds, not a whole bunch in the way of sun. Smithfield. The Greenville section of town, 61 degrees up there. We've got 61 in Providence and Newport, New Bedford, 62, Taunton right now at 60 degrees. We've got a front off to our south and west just kind of hanging out. It's a stationary front on our side of the front. We've got a northeasterly wind and that's a tough wind direction if you want some warm weather. We're looking at chilly conditions with lots of clouds in place today. If we had the, the sunshine, we'd probably easily get into the 80s. However, with the clouds in place and that northeasterly wind, I think we're going to be stuck in the 60s and even low 70s in some spots. So your future cast for today, just a couple of quick sprinkles or a brief shower really at any time through the day, but just generally cloudy skies and cool temperatures. Now tonight, well after uh, dark, closer to midnight, there'll be some showers arriving and we'll see some showers, perhaps even a couple of thunderstorms around tomorrow morning. Here we are at eight o'clock taking you through the rest of the morning. Notice we still looking at the chance for some showers and thunderstorms, some of which could contain some heavy rain. I think throughout the afternoon hours, we'll just see lots of clouds and the chance for a couple of rain showers for tomorrow. I think we'll be drying out tomorrow night. So the best chance for showers and thunder this weekend, likely tomorrow morning into the very early afternoon tomorrow. Here's how your day breaks down today. Just a quick shower, mainly just a sprinkle this morning with mainly cloudy skies, cool temperatures throughout the uh, rest of the AM hours. Here's what the PM hours look like. We are looking at highs all the way up to 70 degrees, a good 13 degrees below average, mainly cloudy skies expected through the afternoon. And again, there might be a couple of raindrops here and there, but generally a dry day expected today. Let's pinpoint the afternoon for you. Temperatures in the mid to upper 60s at the south coast, mainly cloudy, upper 60s in Situate, Johnston, West Warwick, all around 68 degrees. And over in southeastern Mass, Fall River, Taunton, New Bedford, about 67, 68 degrees. If you headed out in the bay, we're looking at winds today, generally from the northeast, 5 to 10 knots. Small waves, high tide about 1230 in the afternoon. Water fire night tonight, and we're looking at some decent uh, conditions, at least for the early part of the uh, evening. Temperatures falling down through the 60s. Toward midnight, there'll be some rain showers around. Here's what we're looking at for your Sunday. Chance for showers and thunderstorms around during the morning into the early afternoon. On Monday, we are looking at, of course, perfect timing. Beautiful weather, sunshine, 79 degrees. Still looks great on Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. The heat and humidity will be building back into the area. Upper 80s to around 90 degrees. So we are looking at dry conditions all of next week. So maybe not a good weekend for the beach, but perhaps a movie walk outside and there's a lot of good movies out there, there as are. well so you gotta you gotta get make time for those too it's true <laughs> thanks tj yeah.